Hi Leo, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back to <coughs> your weekly for the 31st of August till the 6th of September 2020 and we are in Virgo energy and it is a slower energy than the Leo was um, so we have time to um, come back to our uh, inner self in peace that's the time it's actually a beautiful time as well so if you would like to know what the uh, um, Virgo energy is like then have a look at the video that is out there the vi um, Virgo energy it's called okay I thought I might just start doing that each month to get to let everybody know what the energy is like okay well this is your reading and the first card that you have is the three of pentacles you've got recognition for your hard work you have completed something and uh, people are seeing what you have done you've been at working hard at something and you've succeeded you're no longer the apprentice you're qualified now <laughs> it might be literally like that that you've got your qualification you've got the news that um, you are uh, accepted in a university or a, a college or you might have got the job because you've uh, your work is being paid off and your specialization um, is being recognized awesome I hope uh, for those that didn't have work that they're back to work and they've got a new job and that could be also meaning that there might be an, a promotion for some of you then we have the hanged man you might have been in suspension like I said some of you might not have had a job you might be suspended or laid off there was a delay in getting into a new job this could have been for four hours four days four weeks or four months so perhaps you have been without work since uh, August July June the end of April but now you're back to work this is also a spiritual card and the, as the hanged man uh, stands for meditation he chooses to hang upside down but here it is depicted by a whale and it's beautiful and gentle and it's just drifting hanging in there in the divine pure light I love the way it is depicted in this beautiful um, deck it lets your uh, imagination work go in go and focus on this picture and just remember that in your mind when you con are taking time out to meditate or contemplate and also realize that this time after meditation or contemplation do some evaluation that will bring you closer to your next step now you've got 12 so that's a 3 and this is a 3 so you've got a double 3 the angels are showing you a sign they have your back and you're moving up from a 3 2 4 and a 5 so you're going upwards and onwards like I said you're being recognized at the moment okay you've got the 4 of wands you might be getting married there might be celebrations if it isn't a wedding you might be invited to a wedding or you might be moving home as the four of ones represents the four corners of a house so you might be buying a house you might be renting a new house beautiful four also means stability like the house is built on proper foundations otherwise it falls over so it doesn't matter if you've got a new job a new friend and then a, this will be a steady job for with durability and long term and also the friendship you might actually be meeting somebody and that has an eye on you because it's recognition somebody might have an eye on you and you might be going into a steady relationship and which is built on proper foundations awesome so if it isn't a wedding it could be celebrations because you've got this job that you've been going for because we have the five of wands there was 
a lot of competition around okay to me the five of ones is also competition so that's why perhaps that was the delay they had to decide who was better best for the job at hand okay there could have been disagreements as well but definitely the dis disagreements are over okay perhaps because you had a disagreement with somebody that's why you might have stagnated in the friendship or relationship and that was the delay before you could move on and especially the delay if you're getting married could have been a delay for four months because of the COVID fire of the COVID and the uh, uh, lockdown so now you might be able to go forward wow nice one okay at the end of the week we have again recognition the eight of pentacles your skill is being recognized that also means your loyalty to your partner that you were going to get married and now you can it's being recognized your patience is being recognized your hard work is being recognized or you might even start a new study if you've got a new job you want to uh, specialize in your skill then you might even start a new study this could happen even before the month is out before the 31st as you have the eight the eight is the house of money and power you are absolutely in your power you could even be meeting a Leo or a Leo has an eye on you as this is the strength card okay the strength card you are in your powerhouse you hold the key you feel in balance you're no, not scared of any competition at all you are going for what you want and again you've got an eight the eight of cups you definitely want adventure and you want excitement but don't throw old pair of shoes away before you've got a new one and you've got an 8-8 eight, eight. again the angels are showing you that they are there have a look what 8-8 eight, eight is 8 and 8 is 16 1 and 6 is 7 so luck is on your side and again we have Leo um, because the Sun rep also represents Leo and that is 19 19 1 and 9 is a 10 so something is coming to a close there is a new where there is an end there is a new beginning like I said there is definitely a new beginning you might have been laid off but you're coming into action you're not scared of competition you have got two cards that have uh, the word recognition in it this could be privately this could also be uh, publicly that somebody wants to employ you because of your talents and your specialities you're in the spotlight but the spotlight also illuminates things so you might need to do a little bit more research before signing that contract like I said you might have bought that new home well this card signifies moving home or going on holiday the time is fertile for pregnancy for birth birth of a child or birth of a project you might be taking your relationship into the next level or at work you might be getting a promotion look you might be getting married like I said it might have been delayed because of the COVID okay Leo you are in your element definitely you could be meet, meeting up with a Leo you could be partnering up with the Leo or you could take your uh, relationship up uh, um, a notch with a Leo you've got the Queen of Earth talking about pregnancy here you are you've got Mother Earth she also stands for fertility birth growth blossoming and harvesting because she nurtures everything that um, she sows she knows what she sows and apparently you did as well but you were uh, held back there was a delay because of some reason now you're moving onwards and you you are nurturing what you love to do you have passion here 
okay these are all fire you're full of passion you're full of action you're going to go for what you want and you're going to nurture it you're going to make it grow you're going to make it harvest and you're going to pluck the fruit well perhaps you are plucking the fruit or the harvest at the end of this week it could be anything it could be love it could be a job it could be a house okay something with you're doing something with durability and for long term you could be finding out you're pregnant so if you don't want to get pregnant then take precautions now we have the overall that's the overall energy you could also be meeting a Virgo that is the Queen of Earth but don't um, exclude uh, Taurus or Capricorn and the last card that we have is the ninefold sisterhood and the ninefold sisterhood is inspiration you are inspiring others because you've got recognition you're in the spotlight you uh, you might be igniting in, uh, inspiring inspiration to others and that <laughs> they could feel that you are very good and you're ready for the competition Okay, know that you're never alone. Use your intuition. And this card also means prophecy, poetry, change. And know that you are not alone. Okay? You could be the keeper of something big. And uh, you might be stirring the pot you might be cooking something and this is what I'm getting you might be cooking something up you might be putting your ideas into material uh, being putting your ideas out there and actually working on them and materializing them they will return rediment every time like every harvest the 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 Empress or the Queen the Sun the Empress, the, the Queen of Wands, uh, oh, sorry, Pentacles, always plants new seeds. So when the harvest is over and she's gathered the harvest, there will be a new crop growing. You've got many ideas and you're putting them into action. Great stuff. You will re see results this week. Delays are over. Take care. I hope you've enjoyed the reading. And please like and share and have a blessed week. And remember, I go live on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. You can get free cards, but you can also get a question answered if you donate. Take care and be blessed. Thank you.